Welcome to Learn with Priyanka. Question. You have a Google Cloud Storage, GCS, container named Storage 1 that contains the files shown in the following table. You have a Fabric Workspace named Workspace 1 that has the cache for shortcuts enabled. Workspace 1 contains a Lake House named Lake House 1. Lake House 1 has the shortcuts shown in the following table. You need to read data from all the shortcuts. Which shortcuts will retrieve data from the cache? A. Stores only B. Products only C. Stores and products only D. Products, stores and trips E. Trips only F. Products and trips only The correct answer is option C, because cached files have a retention period of 24 hours and all other options are incorrect. Here are a few key points to note. Shortcut caching can be used to reduce egress costs associated with cross-cloud data access. To enable caching for shortcuts, open the Workspace Settings panel, go to the One Lake tab, toggle the cache setting to On, and select Save. According to the documentation, shortcut caching can be used to reduce egress costs associated with cross-cloud data access. As files are read through an external shortcut, the files are stored in a cache for the Fabric workspace. Subsequent read requests are served from cache rather than the remote storage provider. Cached files have a retention period of 24 hours. Each time the file is accessed, the retention period is reset. If the file in remote storage provider is more recent than the file in the cache, the request is served from remote storage provider and the updated file will be stored in cache. If a file hasn't been accessed for more than 24 hours, it's purged from the cache. Individual files greater than 1 GB in size aren't cached. And the note says that shortcut caching is currently supported only for GCS, S3 and S3 compatible shortcuts. GCS was specifically mentioned in the question. See you with another question.